Welcome in Coft and Design 3.0M, dear audience. I will describe some different metal welding project and different core project for the purpose of decoring the indoor and outdoor houses and in front of your small lawn in your in front of your house and if you have some garden in your uh, in front of your house then the different that different ideas will become most suitable dear audience in real welding is a way of heating pieces of metal using electricity or flame so that they melt and stick together there are many kinds of welding like as arc welding the resistant welding and gas welding the most used in welding that type that type are arc welding anyone who is near arc welding needs to wear a special helmet or goggles because the arc is so bright looking at the arc without visual protection may cause permanent eyes damage it also it is also important to cover all your skin because it can give you something like a sabar some different ideas i will give you is flower flower and other different things like as a butterfly like as a uh, uh, a door in front of your garden like as a peacock so hot spark from the weld can burn any skin that is showing one kind of welding that does not use in arc is oxy fuel welding sometimes called gas welding oxy fuel welding and gas welding is the same name oxy fuel welding use uses a flame to heat up the metal there are other kind of welding that do not use an arc in your arc welding any welding process that utilizes an electron electric arc is known as arc welding the common form arc welding includes shield metal arc welding which is used in that type in that use uh, picture like as uh, you see that flower you see that a dog in the garden which is sitting gas metal in that in that situation gas melting or, or use gas tungsten arc welding that is also a type of uh, arc welding Arc welding heats metal by making a high current electric or between piece of metal to be joined and an electrode and an a piece piece of metal use of electrode varies based on the type of welding process that SMRW means shield metal arc welding so as gas metal arc welding and relating welding process the electrode is consumed and become part of weld the electrode is usually made of the same kind of metal to be welded because the electrode is consumed by the welding process process the electrode must constantly be fed into the weld the shield metal arc welding project stick a stick electrodes 
impregnated with a weld promoter known as flux clamped to the end the gas metal the gas metal welding project uses a thin wire on a rotating spool as a continuous electrode the size of the electrode varies from around 0.635 mm to about 4 mm the welding machine has a motor driven pole inside that feeds the wire electrodes into the weld the tid welding process features an electrode that is not consumed by the welding process as the metal that makes up the weld does not any electricity flowing through it the electrode is made of tungsten so used as it will not melt will immerse in the electrical arc a filer metal in the form of a rod can be used to add metal to the weld area different pieces in which fork welding are much usable and the that pieces are not melt in high level of heat high potency of heat almost all welding uses filer metal to fill in the small gap between the metal pieces the extra metal helps to make the weld strong sometime weld need to be made without any filer metal welding with no filer metal is called autogenous welding when we don't use when we not use any welding then that called autogenous welding no filer in which we we not use uh, no filer metal so shielding in or the uh, arc welding all types of welding requires that the hot metal have protection dirt or rust grease and even the oxidation of the metal under the weld process can prevent a proper weld joint as such welding process use one of two protection method flux and shielding gas there are audience uh, over different ideas i will describe you uh, i think that is most most inspiration of use and you use in different decorations uh, of your home and your garden and your lawn so thank you guys uh, thank you very much